Hey there guys, Fave here. I've been doing this YouTube thing for a really long time, and I also haven't activated the face cam in a while and I can't find my bowler. So I've been doing this YouTube thing for a really long time, much longer than most of you even think. If you go to my channel, it'll tell you that I joined on August 28th, 2010. And yes, that is the date that I created this channel, Roblox Fave, as it was titled back in the day. And yes, I recently hit 100 million views, woo! And today's challenge is, if you've ever sneezed before, smash that like button. Also, I noticed most of you aren't subscribed, so what are you doing? Go ahead and subscribe and hit that bell! Okay, so, right, this channel was created in 2010, but however, Fave was not my first channel. Most of my first channels either have all the videos deleted, or were deleted for copyright because young 7 year old Fave thought it was a good idea to upload full Spongebob episodes to YouTube, Spoiler alert, it's not. Besides all that, there is some old channels that exist if you dig deep enough. I don't recommend you do, I'm not proud of those channels. However, we're gonna be looking at the first Fave videos. Now, yes, I used the Fave account on my other channel, but this is when I created the separate channel, which ironically, I only made this channel because I legit forgot the password to my last one. This is the oldest channel I own as far as I'm concerned. So here we are on my channel, okay? The beautiful banner, the profile pic. We're gonna go all the way to the beginning of when this all started. And we're gonna start from the very first video entitled, New YouTube DX. Hello. Welcome to my new YouTube account. This music is real bouncy. I like it. What am I laughing at? Okay, bye. That's a thing people used to say a lot. K okay, bye. I don't do people still say that? It's like saying, okay, bye, but like in 2010 lingo. That was a fun phrase back then. So this is the first video I uploaded to this channel. And basically I was just saying, this is my new channel. And you know, not everyone gets to get 81,000 views, but then again, it is the first video on this channel, which this channel's been through quite a lot over 11 years. You know, as we are 11 years old, basically, I'm, I'm a, this channel's old as a lot of you watching, so that's pretty crazy. But yeah, I was just introducing my, or reintroducing myself, depending on who you were. Yes, ICT got the first comment ever or something. You know, the comments are cool, like woot. RIP 2010 memories, good old days before Adopt Me, Ragdoll came along and ruined everything. And then of course, my favorite comment, 000, a legend was born. If you don't have this comment on your first video, have you really made it as a YouTuber yet? But regardless, we have to move on to my second video. Okay, to avoid the YouTube copyright gods from coming down onto this video and striking me with bolts of lightning, I have to explain this. So, back in the day, Roblox music videos were still a big genre. I think nowadays what's more famous are like the original songs people animate and make about Roblox. But back then, a Roblox music video was just typing into bubble chat, synchronizing it up with the lyrics. There was a lot to, of fun to be had with that genre. And I was out here pioneering this stuff back in 2010. And I was doing it before that too, but it's the first one on here. So this is the Scatman music video from 2010. Um, you can see I'm at the Iron Cafe, which was one of the most popular games back in the day. You know, you let the video play on while it's muted. You can see my boy hitting the sick drum solo. I mean, dang, bro. Go in, I guess. And then here's me slamming the door of the bathroom over and over. That was my idea of comedy in 2010. Dancing with a guitar on a chair. I mean, this video is super lit. Look at the drip here. Look at the drip here. Come on, man. You can't say this dude wasn't ballin', bro. Look at this dude. An absolute legend. If then we have the third video, which would go on to literally build my channel from the ground up. This video is called 10 Ways to Tell If You're a Noob on Roblox. Now this video from September 2010 was basically the start of it all, okay? This is the video where it all began because for a while, this was one of the most viewed Roblox videos of all time. If you searched up Roblox on YouTube, this would be like the third result or something. And having a few hundred thousand views back then was such a big deal, such a monumental occasion. It's crazy how I can regularly do that now, but back then it was something else. 
and of course there was a slew of sequels that spawned from it, dating all the way to 2014. So this was the original series that really blew my channel up, got me to a thousand subscribers by 2012. It was the early days, and yes, online dating still existed. People think it's a new thing that's ruining Roblox, but there have always been online daters, and they're always going to exist. That's just how Roblox works, unfortunately. Anyways, what, what else was I making back then? Now, Roblox Madness 2 Fail Edition, I'm only going to bring it up because I want to tell you guys about Roblox Madness. Roblox Madness was the series back then, bro. I started it in 2010 on my old channel, actually, and Roblox Madness 2 was the first one I posted to this channel. And there's about 12 Roblox Madnesses dating all the way to 2013. These are all my original series that I started my channel with back then. It's basically like Roblox bloopers, but most of you probably don't know what that is, so I would explain it like it's a bunch of little skits, a little comedy segments and the, the, to differing degrees of funniness. The thing about Roblox Madness 2 is the video that you see on YouTube is not what the video was supposed to be. I was editing in Windows Movie Maker, the most professional editing software, and the, when I went to go render the video, it all got shuffled and out of order, and that's why it's called Fail Edition, because the whole video itself is a failure. I still posted it though, because nine-year-old me did not care. Next up we have Roblox Unfair Ban, which is kind of like a direct follow-up to the Scatman video, because I got a one-day ban for sending a YouTube link. Now for those of you that are confused, back in 2010 you were not allowed to link any off-site links at all. No YouTube, no Twitter, none of that. So you would get banned for sending a YouTube link, as you can see here. This is the link to the Scatman music video. You have some skits here, there's not much to say about these videos. And then you have the first intro. Now intros are still a thing many YouTubers do. Fave Productions. So, my channel would go through many intros. I had this one, I had the longer 2011 one, I had a short 2012 one, and then a 2013 remaster of the 2012 one, and then I kind of gave up on intros altogether to be replaced with outros, which would become more lucrative for YouTubers, especially in that era, because you could add end screens and annotations, and it was annotations back then and end screens now. But if you're a YouTuber on the come up, dude, I mean, intros are good now because they can help establish a brand for yourself, but, you know, not convoluted long intros like this though this is like a thing of the past that used to be very common you got more ripped audio meteors what is meteors an average day oh this music it's so peaceful oh my god i love the frame rate on this video too dude oh, i just record this on a potato or something this is so violent. Why is there so many explosion sound effects? I feel like I just downloaded like a bunch of them and put them all in the video. It's like I'm flexing how slow my computer was. I mean, that, that happy home in Robloxia is absolutely decimated. And then I pause the explosion. I love old Roblox. I thought it was such a cool feature in Roblox Studio that you could click the pause button. And boom, let it fly away. Stuff's getting smacked around left and right. It's beautiful, dude. It's after the damages. I spelled damages wrong. Yeah, <laughs> the village is kind of messed up. Some of these blocks and towers still stood still, though. You know, these are the things you were supposed to build with back then at the happy home. But yeah, this video, mwah, A1. Good stuff, good stuff, respect. Weird things on Roblox. This sounds like a video I would make now. Welcome to Fave's Weird Things on Roblox show. It's from September 20th, 2010. Whoa, whoa, Fave, the language, my goodness, dude, jeez. It's a subliminal messaging? I did not edit that in. Why is there a random epic face just chilling in the video? Hold on. What? 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 I... Dude, subliminal messaging, that's some dangerous stuff. Nine-year-old Fave was really out here manipulating the brains of his viewers. Anyways, uh, Doodle858 said, I don't like your username. Well, I don't like your username, Doodle858. Is this dude still around, Doodle858? So he got a waffle maker. You see his drip here, he's an old man. Obviously, if you're on Roblox 10 years ago, 11 years ago, you're an old man now. That includes me too, so, oh well. And yeah, this person hasn't been on in a very long time, unfortunately. Maybe Doodle858 will come back to Roblox one day. 
Then we have me predicting the future with FreeCreditReport.com commercial. This was a commercial that aired on TV around 2008, and I was a big fan. I did all of the commercials on Roblox. Then somewhere in like 2017 or 18 or so, it became a meme people would post on. And this video got a big boom in views eight years later. As you can see by the comments, dude, like the comments are all from the same time. Not 11 years ago, but... As Kelly Pro put it, truly ahead of its time. But well, that wouldn't be the last time I'd predict the future. But that's the last time I'm gonna look at these old videos. If y'all really like this one, I'll look at more of them. Maybe I'll even do the, the whole channel. There's no way I have too many videos for that. But thanks for watching the video. Make sure you smash that like button. Follow me on Instagram at Fave here. Join my groups on Roblox, Roblox, Fan Club, and Fave's Cave. Check out the channel membership, which is the join button next to the subscribe button for early access to videos, exclusive emojis, and more. Members saw this video first. Join my Discord server, discord.dg slash Fave. And it's your boy Fave, and I am out.